Hi, I'm Heert and it's been a while I made a video of the developments of the uh, Netherlands uh, reactor cash group. Um, I made uh, a new power supply. I'm going to show it. So I can I can control speed of three uh, motors. Uh, I can read out the voltages and the amperage, the amps. Uh, I also finished the uh, feed through, so it can uh, spin uh, separate from the uh, outer core. I uh, made also some stuff on my 3D printer to make the uh, 50 centimeter hose more compact so um, I can load in here the one bar gas one bar then I take 50 centimeter one centimeter and load it with the other gases in the, in the sphere the um, flux detector is uh, also uh, fixed now it's finished that was uh, the id from uh, out from our group so we can read out on the oscilloscope if there's something's going on uh, like now i just uh, did some tests today for a couple of hours and loaded uh, the gases. I took um, hydrogen, uh, the red one is uh, argon and the blue one is not connected so I took uh, air with uh, atmospherical pressure and took one centimeter of it also. The yellow one is not connected, it's a spare for uh, another gas. So. I had some some results. Uh, I I took a, a, a quick video of it, and I show it uh, after this one. Now I I bought also the double uh, PS seal. And that's the one. It's a back to back. See. Oh. It's a back to back. Okay. And this is the numbers of it. Okay. I bought also some high vacuum uh, grease. That's the one. Uh, from Dow Corning. Okay. I finished uh, a new housing also for the uh, inner core so the the uh, seals uh, gonna be fixed in here and the housing oh it's like that okay that's the housing for it okay it's the same method that I did in here so the inner sphere can spin separate from the outer core. Um, okay, now um, I did some tests. I said uh, um, that I uh, used uh, two gases and air and I have had some results. Uh, on the oscilloscope, I'm gonna show you what I did. Okay. On the oscilloscope, uh, it's been on the uh, five milli millivolts. It's been on five millivolts. It's not much, I know, <laughs> but it was all over this, the the uh, display. And um, 
when I changed it to uh, 20 millivolts, I saw the spikes to 20, 30, 50 millivolts. Okay. Right now, normally it's a flat line, but um, it's now uh, an hour ago when I stopped the sphere, and it still has something in it. Uh, is it the plasma? I don't know. The uh, uh, copper wire is not, is not uh, in contact with the uh, the metal frame. It's complete, separated, connected like that. And when I touch it, when I I touch it like this, I get some reactions. See. So there's definitely something's going on inside. Uh, it's been spinning uh, the first half hour for uh, 2000 rounds a minute to um, layer the gases. And then I um, think it's uh, three hours. It's been spinning three hours and a half, I think, um, by 500 rounds a minute. And that's the result. I show you the video after uh, this one. I post it uh, after this one. Okay. So that's it. Um, now I hope I can uh, lay my hands on some uh, helium. Uh, so we could um, have some scintillation um, and maybe uh, better results. Okay, bye-bye.